Taylor Swift and Travis Kells seal Bahamas vacation with a kiss. The pictures capture Taylor Swift and Travis Kells kissing each other during their trip to Harbor Island in the Bahamas. Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey's romance is going on in full swing. The singing sensation and the NFL player have been spotted on numerous occasions, engaging in some PDA. While Taylor Swift recently wrapped up the international leg of her era's tour concert that is to resume again in May, Travis Kells clinched the Super Bowl 2024 title for his team, the Kansas City Chiefs, in February. Now that the two lovebirds are on a temporary break from their respective work commitments, they embarked on a coastal trip to the Bahamas. Recently, pictures of the couple sealing their love with a kiss at the destination have gone viral. Obtained by the New York Post, the pictures capture Taylor Swift and Travis Kells kissing each other, submerged in the blue waters of the Harbor Island. The fearless singer donned an itty-bitty yellow bikini and held a glass of beverage in her hands. She sported a pair of Uber Calls sunglasses while her hair was tied in a messy ponytail. Travis Kells displayed his sculpted physique in blue and white printed shorts. In another group of photos, Taylor Swift and Travis Kells were seen holding hands as they waded across the waters, embraced in each other's arms, the duo sunbathed on the beach, lying on a mat. From enjoying cruise rides to simply relaxing on the sandy shores, the two celebrities appeared to have the time of their lives at the location. According to a source by People, Taylor Swift and Travis Kelv vacationed in the Bahamas for several days as it was a much-needed break for both of them. Post their Bahamas vacation, Taylor Swift and Travis Kelv were spotted enjoying a lunch date in Malibu on March 25, reports People. They were clicked leaving the Nobu restaurant hand-in-hand, hand, while Swift was dressed in a blue full-sleeved cardigan and pleated beige skirt, Kels wore a round colored white t-shirt and black joggers. On the work front, Taylor Swift will be performing at the Paris La Defense Arena in France as a part of her era's tour concert from May 9 to 12. Ahead of that on April 19, she will be releasing her 11th studio album, The Tortured Poets Department. Meanwhile, Travis Kels would be returning to his summer training camp in July. Taylor Swift and boyfriend Travis Kels hit Dog Pound Gym for private workout session in West Hollywood. Taylor Swift and boyfriend Travis Kels shut down Dog Pound Gym for a private workout session in West Hollywood on Sunday following a sushi date at Nobu. The lovebirds, who have been hunkering down at her $25 million Beverly Hills after returning from their romantic trip to the Bahamas, managed to squeeze in a sweat session amid their busy schedules. An eyewitness told DailyMail.com that other gym members waited outside for two hours until the duo finished their training session. The pop star, 34, previously revealed she got in tip-top shape for the era's tour by singing on the treadmill, lifting weights and strength training at Dog Pound six months before opening night last March. I knew this tour was harder than anything I'd ever done before by a long shot, Swift told Time in December. I finally, for the very first time, physically prepared correctly. In addition to not drinking alcohol, the cardigan hitmaker detailed how she trained to perform her three-hour, 15-minute concerts. Every day I would run on the treadmill, singing the entire set list out loud, she continued, fast for fast songs and a jog or a fast walk for slow songs. Three months before the tour, Taylor also began working relentlessly with choreographer Mandy Moore to learn the dance moves. Mandy was recommended to her by her pal Emma Stone. Emma had previously worked with Mandy on the musical La La Land. The pop star admitted, learning choreography is not my strong suit. I had three months of dance training because I wanted to get it in my bones. I wanted to be so over-rehearsed that I could be silly with the fans and not lose my train of thought. The musician told the publication that in the past she lived like a frat guy on the road, but this time was different. She explained that she cut out alcohol completely ahead of the tour, adding, doing that show with a hangover, I don't want to know that world. While Swift is undeniably a force to be reckoned with in the gym, Kels, a three-time Super Bowl champion, may be her perfect workout buddy. During the first few months of their romance, which began in September, the duo spent much of their time jetting off to see one another. But things have slowed down for them as of late, with her latest leg of the cruel summer songstress era's tour ending in early March and the athlete's football season coming to an end last month. 
After a wild six months filled with busy schedules, constant traveling, and cameras surrounding their every move, it was said that the pair were planning to play house inside her Beverly Hills mansion. They are enjoying movie nights in her home theater, catching up on films and shows they've missed. An insider told us weekly earlier this month, they can finally rest and intend on spending quality time together and with friends and family. This is the first time the two of them have had no commitments and they are both really looking forward to being a normal couple and playing house. Last week, the New York Post revealed the shocking amount of money that Kels, also 34, had reportedly spent on wooing Swift. The publication estimated that he spent a whopping $8 million on everything from private jet rides to lavish gifts. It claimed that Travis spent around $22,000 on Valentine's Day presents for the pop star alone. This are said to have included a slew of designer clothes and accessories, a $3,050 24-karat gold rose sculpture from the luxury furniture company Paragold, and two boxes of 250 roses Eternity Roses, which are said to last up to a year and cost $2,199 each. And it didn't end there. It was also reported that he gifted her a $1,050 black lambskin deer barret, a $1,100 Celine hat, a $5,100 Bottega Veneta purse, and a $1,300 Hermes Chevo Decane shawl. Last but not least, the athlete got himself and Taylor, whose net worth is estimated to be $1.1 billion, custom matching bracelets with the letters TNT, standing for Taylor and Travis, written in diamond-encrusted gold beads. The outlet added that Travis has already forked over $1.2 million on private jet rides so that he could support his girlfriend at her shows. By far Travis' greatest expense, however, was the new home he felt the need to buy after he started dating the hitmaker. He bought a 17,000-square-foot mansion in the Kansas City suburb of Leewood for $6 million after his $1 million house reportedly made him feel self-conscious. His new abode comes with six bedrooms, six bathrooms, a Beverly Hills-style pool, a garage with space for six cars, a tennis and pickleball court, a miniature golf course, a wine cellar, a two-level cinema room, and a substantial garden to give him and Taylor extra privacy from fans and the media.